a blessed Wednesday. This is Sister Maria Carmela of the Daughters of St. Paul for today's Gospel Power. The kingdom of heaven is like treasure hidden in a field, which someone found and hid. Then in his joy he goes and sells all that he has and buys that field. Again, the kingdom of heaven is like a merchant in search of fine pearls. On finding one pearl of great value, he went and sold all that he had and bought it. For Jesus, heaven is home, and home means being with His Father. It is this reality, this sense of being with the Father, this intimate relationship with God, that Jesus has come to establish on earth, calling it Kingdom of Heaven. It cannot be described adequately in words. So Jesus uses two parables to speak of its inestimable worth. It is the absolute value, for we find in it the meaning and purpose of our existence. Relationship with God is the ground of our being and the object of our most ardent longing, even before we become conscious of it. The actions of the characters of the twin parables, unexpected discovery of the buried treasure, and earnest search for the finest pearl, are ways of coming to awareness of this absolute value the initiative to sell all to acquire it implies surrendering oneself to it in plain language it means allowing god to possess one's heart and to claim one's life as god's own this is what it means to belong to the kingdom of heaven let us pray Lord Jesus, may we never hold back anything but risk all to belong to God's kingdom of love. Amen. We stand before you, Holy Spirit, as we gather together in your name. With you alone to guide us, make yourself at home in our hearts. It's us the way we must go and how we are to pursue it. We are weak and sinful. Do not let us promote disorder. Do not let ignorance lead us down the wrong path, nor partiality influence our actions. Let us find in you our unity so that we may journey together to eternal life and not stray from the way of truth and what is right. All this we ask of you, who are at work in every place and time, in the communion of the Father and the Son, forever and ever. Amen. 